My mother died when I was one year old. So my grandmother was a very big uh, influence uh, in, in my life. She always wanted to take geography as a little girl. But in those days, only boys were permitted. And I always kept thinking, what could I do to immortalize her? And then one day, I was thinking about a scholarship because she couldn't take geography. I wanted a scholarship for, for a female. It gives me great pleasure when I think about it. The job of the gift planner is, is to work with uh, our members in formulating uh, their legacy plans and then providing a roadmap, if you will, to how to realize those plans. It's not just looking into gifts to ministry, but it's also gifts to family and friends and other institutions. The gift planner will prepare you then to have the conversation with the lawyer or the financial planner because you already walk in with a plan. You are telling them, this is what I want to do. You don't have the idea until somebody breaks it to you. At our age, we don't have kids that we can leave the whole mess to. We just have to have some sort of a plan. We look forward to seeing Pastor Anna, because she's always got some ideas or helpful tips or update, and it's been really, we appreciate that very much. Part of our response to the gospel is this joyful response of financially supporting the ministry and the mission. When we're alive, we are supporting our churches and institutions and our families with our financial gifts. But what happens when we're no longer here? So that's, I look at it as the third leg of stewardship. If somebody gets a scholarship, will ease the burden on young students. We've had really a lot of fun and seen a lot of the world, and uh, we just think it's time to pay back to society. If you're interested in growing your own legacy or bringing planned giving to your congregation, please contact me, your regional gift planner for the Carolinas, Stephanie Burke, at 704-293-9436 or at stephanie.burke at elca.org.